If you know that there are different species of passion fruit, well, I didn't know, and I got quite a surprise when my mom got back from Portugal and she had brought a few. I went online and tried to do some research, but I thought it was really hard to differentiate the ones that I had and the ones that I could find on the internet. So therefore, this will only be my experience. We had an orange yellow one, which was gray inside, and it didn't really look that pleasant. It was kind of mild and it was kind of sweet in the taste, but it didn't taste like a whole lot. And then there's the second one, which kind of looked like a potato and it also had the same color and the same size as a big one. But the taste of it was really sour. I know a regular passion fruit is also kind of sour, but this was tasting more like a lime, I would say. Somehow I found this on Amazon in India, currently on sale down from a thousand. And when I calculated that, it was about 5.6 USD dollars. Third one was like an even bigger passion fruit, which actually looked sort of good. Who wouldn't like a giant passion fruit? However, as far as I remember, it didn't taste like a whole lot. So it was actually a bit of a disappointment. And the fourth one, that was like a green one and it was kind of longish. It didn't really look like a passion fruit on the inside. And the taste was sort of like a melon, not a passion fruit. Maybe we got tricked by the salesman. And the fifth one is called the banana passion fruit and it probably got its name because it kind of looks like a banana. However, it didn't taste anything like a banana. It wasn't tasting super pleasant. It was just kind of bitter. Then there was one that sort of looked like a tomato. And if you think about it, like a tomato has these tiny kernels, kind of like a passion fruit. So maybe this was actually a sort of tomato or something, but it didn't taste anything like a passion fruit either. It was more like a papaya that had gone bad. So smelling and tasting sort of like vomit. So that was not a good one. Disclaimer, we don't actually know how these passion fruits were meant to taste or whether they were ripe or not. That was it for now. So if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time. Peace.